a bit uneasy. We'll get him. Sunny, maybe. <laughs> to my girlfriend, she left me last week. Yeah. Um, somewhere tropical would be would be awesome. I'm a field officer. 
your deportation. We don't talk. Hey, hey I know the rules, okay? Just be nice to know where I'm going for a change. That's all I'm saying. You're in early, Joe? Double shift. Understaffed again. I just brought in three new guys to train up, though, so... I'll be out of here in no time. You and me both, hopefully. How, uh... How did the exam go? Better. I think I did it this time. I still don't get it, Ren. Why don't you just transfer to one of the other agencies like I'm doing? around there's nowhere near enough budget for this my dad was a field officer his dad was a field officer and I'm gonna be a field officer even if you do end up in the field there won't be any older guards left soon that's why they haven't spent anything on this place in years then I'll be the last agent standing Joe to maintenance the electrified light field at the left entrance is down again can someone with half a brain cell please get down there and fix it Deportation zone today, prepping the cell, so it'll have to wait. It's your funeral. I hope it's good news this time. Me too. Oh, the uh, newbies are upstairs, by the way. It's your turn to give them the talk. Seriously? Can you do it for me? Not a chance. Unless that letter says different, they're 100% your problem. Mom, I guess I'm about to find out. Good luck. Agent Reed, how can I help? What's wrong with you? Same old shit. I failed the test again. Oh, man, I'm 
I'm sorry. As if you didn't know already. Yeah, but still. You should have given me a heads up, Jay. We can talk about this later. I've got news. Big news. How big? We got them before. Washburn, how can I help? Roger that. We'll be ready. Attention, we have a level 10 hostile inbound on non-essential personnel. Sight immediately. Drop whatever you're doing and go. You can lose the hood now. Well, great work as always, guys. I have absolutely no idea what we do, but uh, go team. You're needed at the black site. No, 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 no. Um, like I told you, my girlfriend's left me. I need to get a flight back to see her. Can't you get someone else to do it just this once? Level 10 deportation officer needed. You're the closest. Sorry. You know, I do have a photographic memory. I'll be taking you through orientation for your new roles here at the Artemis International Black Site. The Black Site operated as a global headquarter for Artemis between 1941 and the early 70s. Ever since, the facility has been mostly closed down and is used for deportations only, as and when it's needed. So this place is super dangerous, right? Occasionally. We run the site on the skeleton crew between deportations, because we have one hell of a security system. So most of the time you'll be more than safe, even though you can't see it. Yo, okay, but I haven't seen any guns. Guns don't work on the black site. Why not? In the 1980s, we captured the Eldegar Suda and brought him here for deportation. Suda's worshippers seized the facility, and a lot of good agents were killed. After that, the site was warded to stop it from ever happening again, with the markings that you can see all around this building. The incantations used prevent combustion from occurring on site, making explosions and gunfire impossible. There's no hot water, and all hot food is microwaved. You're gonna want thermal underwear for the winter. Hang on, so I can't smoke on site? Only if you get electrocuted. All right, please watch the following video carefully. Welcome, I'm Professor August Kellerman, Chief Research Officer for Artemis. This facility is one of three designated Site Beta. Its purpose is the research, questioning, and deportation of the Elder Gods using incantations from ancient texts, translated by myself. <clears throat> and the team of experts here at Artemis. As a member of the Artemis Black Site team, you may be asked to perform various duties. Each job is important and ensures the continued safety of the entire human race. Soon after their release in 1926, we discovered that the Elder Gods had been weakened by their time in the other dimension, greatly reducing their power and size. One form of recovery for them is to hide inside a human vessel and drain them of their life force or essence. Using hitherto forgotten scripts, the research team here at Artemis have been able to train our field teams to bind the Elder Gods to a human vessel, thus making them safe for transportation to this site where they will be deported. Do not make eye contact directly with an Elder. 
to the untrained mind, the effects can be irreversible. Uh, actually, this video is a little outdated. As I said, you can't smoke on the black side anymore. Reed, mind if we talk? They've caught him, you know. Erebus, the one that killed your parents. I got the call. John Austin. He recommended I send you home on this one. Did he tell you that? You can't. I can. I'm the boss. But luckily for you, I think seeing this thing deported will actually do you some good. Face your fears. Type of thing my mom would have done to me. She was a mean old bitch, that one. You don't have a mom. So consider it a freebie. Thank you. That means a lot to me. The deportation officer will be arriving later today. You're gonna sign him in, prep him, and take him down to the bye-bye room. Then you can watch that piece of shit go back to where it came from. After this, though, no more trying to pass your exam. Commit to your job here, and we move on. Erebus is being brought in now in the wagon. I expect you not to interfere with the interrogation. Just get Sam, Levi, ready for the deportation. Go on, then. Out you go. Level 10, hostile, inbound. All non-essential personnel must leave the site now. Check all your weapons in at the main door and collect the baton. Let's get this asshole down to the interrogation room as quick as we can. No mistakes. Is he secure? Yes, sir. I'll be in, sir. What are you still doing here? Your request to have me sent home was denied. Fuck, Ren. You can't be here. Who knows what effect this asshole's gonna have on you once he's awake. Just, just go home. I have every right to watch this fucker get deported, Jay. And you know it. If your dad was here, he'd want me to send you somewhere safe. Well, he isn't, Jay. It's not your fault that he isn't either. Look, I'm grateful for everything that you and your mom did for me. But you're not my guardian. This thing took him away from me. And I want to see his eyes when you send him back. Besides, I'm on duty. I'm checking the deportation officer in. Yeah, who we got? Um, Sam something? Sam Levi. Fuck, not that guy. Why? What's wrong with him? <sighs> Nothing, he's just, just kind of boring. <sighs> okay, you can stay, and I won't complain about it. But if you start to see things, I want you to promise me you will go home. Just don't go easy on him in there. I won't. meat suit you put me in. It's hardly five-star accommodation, is it? No. 
Pain. Such a fleetingly mortal experience. The playing rough won't get you anywhere with me. Oh, yeah. We'll see about that. Will you pointless specks of dust hurry up and get this conversation over and done with? I believe I have a deportation to attend. Plenty of time for that. After all, you've got an eternity to waste. So, let's get down to business. Erebus, the devourer, the filler of space, he who comes in the dark. Quite the impressive list of titles you have. You humans. Always trying to give names to things. As if it would give you some sort of ownership over it. <laughs> the truth is, nothing in the cosmos cares what you call it. Nothing in the cosmos cares about you at all. Oh, this is turning into the worst first date ever. Let's start again, shall we? What would you like me to call you? <laughs> For you to speak my true name, I would have to cut your tongue out. <laughs> well, I think we'll pass on that. This fine fellow whose body you're currently wearing is convicted murderer Jerome Davis. He sounds fun. Jerome it is, then. So, Jerome. This is how it works. I need the name and location of one other Elder God, and then we can make all this unpleasantness just go away and send you back to hell quickly. How does that sound? <sighs> the illusion of power. <laughs> it must feel nice. Comforting, even. But I am one of the first five things in all of existence. Born from the chaos of this universe. <sighs> Time and space present themselves to me in a way you couldn't possibly imagine. And even though mankind knows this, you're still arrogant enough to think you might have anything over something like me. <laughs> What's funny, Jerome, is that the Elder God Nix apparently said something very similar. You and her were close, right? Her intel kept us busy for years. You are not fit to speak her name. She was Agent Austin's first ever deportation, I believe. Must have been a lonely 20 years for you without her. If it wasn't for these symbols and cheap parlor tricks that you have bound me with, I would turn you and everybody in this facility inside out. Just to pass the time. Well, I'll uh, bear that in mind. While we torture the shit out of you. Agent Ren Reed. You might want to keep this one covered up whilst you wait. Why? He's a talker. I can't handle that. There are currently two 
Visitors on site. I'm Sam. Sam Levy. I know. Sorry, um, is what's on the agenda today? Well, it's need to know only, and you... Don't tell me. I don't need to know. Me again. Um, seriously, what is the plan for today? Because my girlfriend's at home, she's packing up all of her stuff as we speak, and I kind of need to get back to her ASAP. So did you dump her or she dumped you? Nobody dumped anybody. It's complicated. She dumped you. What did you do? I didn't do anything. If you must know, she, um, she called me boring. Yeah, I heard that. So you want to know the plan? Uh, okay, well, basically we're gonna stay here until they call for us over the intercom, at which point you'll put back on the hood and the earphones, and when they ask you to, you will recite a piece of text that apparently you've memorized. Sound good? Sounds boring, actually. Well, you would know. Huh. All right, I'm gonna go and get us some drinks while we wait. This door locks automatically, so don't go trying to look around. Fine. I don't know I've got anywhere important to be. Good boy. This isn't working. I say we just send him down to the by my room and deport him. With all due respect. We got a lot more we can hear about the first. Trust me, Agent Oz. I'd love to sit here and watch you cut fingers and toes off all night. There are some kidney stones that just can't piss out. You understand what I'm saying. Get him down to deportation. I owe Rob Reed. I'm the reason Airbus got away that night. I'm the reason Ren's family are dead. Uh, Renry. She's grown up to be such a disappointment. Shut your mouth. You know, I felt her her entire life. We're connected. I can feel her now. In this building. Just as I always knew she would be. What are you talking about? I feel a little reunion coming. How do I look? I need to go get ran off site just in case. Agreed, let's go. Get this piece of shit down to a cell. We'll bring back down the deportation officer. Uh, I hate to burst your little alpha human bubble. But you're already too late. Yeah? Why is that? Because they're already here. Joe, can I get a check on the left entrance, please? I've already told maintenance the whole area is down. We can't see anything from this end. Roger that. I'll take a look.
Left entrance come in. What did you find? <coughs> Left entrance, come in. <coughs> Hello? Those are need to know. So why put them in a waiting room? So that if someone like you touches them, then I have a legitimate excuse to hurt you. Oh. Wow. I'm glad I'm not the only one not getting any. You know, I used to date a guy like you. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Boring. He's all clingy and needy. You know how I broke up with him? Uh, how, how? Over text. <laughs> Charming. I'm just saying. Your girlfriend could have been much harsher. That would have been. Okay, the gas has started to clear, but there are still plenty of active cameras left. Keep your mask on, unless you want to end up getting picked up by Artemis. Got it. Keep your mask on. We have a situation in the blues of <laughs> the Find the deportation officer. Do not kill him. Copy that. Follow me. Security protocol 18 is now in effect. Lockdown will commence in three minutes. moved Erebus to the deportation zone already. I'm just trying to find you a route now. There are two more agents headed your way. The ELF will activate. Hold on. Where is Erebus? Kill the folks. door behind you. Keep turning left. Erebus is there. Give me Erebus and we'll go. You better be sure you can win this. Otherwise you're gonna wish you found Jesus instead. Security protocol 18 is now Electrified lights. 
wrong with you? Snap out of it. Come on. Some woman came on here and the gum said we were under attack. Shh. Hold on. I heard something. All clear. Same here. Fuck. I gotta get you down to the deportation room. Are you joking? You listen to me, dickhead. I don't know you, and I don't care what your hang-ups are. The closest person I have to family is trapped in there. So you're gonna get over your fucking self, and you're gonna come with me. Am I making myself clear? We found Kerr. He called that door. How long? What are we supposed to do now? Radio the others and find them. We're gonna get Erebus out of that body. We need him alive. We'll find him. You two, come with me. Access denied. Electrified life field still activated. Over here. You've met Kerr. How do you like your new cell? More cheap parlor tricks. Okay? I'm hurt pretty bad. How bad? That's not important. Yes, it is. Tell me. You need to get Sam Levi out of here. Erebus is no good to them without him. Fuck that. Rand. Hang in there. I'm coming. Hey, hey. You see a bad guy, you stab him. Got it? I know. Oh, what do we do now? Your file said you have photographic memory. Yeah, so? So if we're gonna get you down to that room and prove you're not the boring fuckface everybody says you are, we're gonna need something first. Boring fuckface? What are these symbols for? They're called wards. They protect the facility against certain types of attack. They activated when the security system switched on. Huh. And what about that? Is that part of the security system too? Mm-hmm. 
That is an ELF, short for Electrified Light Field. Yeah, go through that and you'll know what a Pop-Tart feels like at breakfast. Well, how are we supposed to get through that? I'll show you. Sorry to interrupt, guys. Huh. You don't know where the bathroom is, do you? You're not going anywhere. Yeah, let's cut her up. Electrified life is still active. <laughs> <laughs> Come and do something. You know, you got real communication issues. I'm not gonna lie to you, Jay. You might need a few stitches. Ooh. That doesn't look good. Go fuck yourself. You can make all the jokes you want, old timer. It won't matter. You're still going back by the end of tonight. I'll never get used to that stench of human arrogance. You know, you're like the sweaty armpit of the cosmos. <laughs> <laughs> you elder gods all talk a big game. I always like to remind us how insignificant you think we are. Yet here you are hiding on our planet and living inside human hosts. You know, there was a time when I was so powerful. <laughs> so beyond what your little minds could comprehend. I didn't even notice your kind. You crave attention, like little children. And you stripped us of our glory, and then our home. And you had no right or reason. You know, I have had eons to reflect on your kind things we could have done, the mistakes we might have made. But ultimately, 
I realized just how utterly pointless you are. Does that not bother you? Do you not fear your own insignificance? We have each other. There's more significance in that than a thing like you could ever understand. See, eventually, it'll come down to you or us. And we chose us. I had companionship on a scale you would never understand. And then you took her from me. And deported her. Gives your species the right to do the things that you do to mine. It gives us purpose. Touche. Well, let's hope our little mutual friend Ren finds her purpose this evening. Sit. This facility is split into three zones, blue, green, and red. We're currently in red zone. Each zone is separated by the ELF security system. Now this folder contains all the deactivation codes for each zone. So use your oversized brain and remember the codes. before we're both finally killed. The ELF box is right here. What's going on with you? <sighs> Nothing. Really? I saw an elder gun when I was a kid. It fucked me up. I'm dealing with it. Wait, is that where they cover my eyes and ears? So I don't go crazy? I'm not crazy. Ever since they brought Erebus into the facility, the things I've been seeing are getting more intense. Well, what can we do? Switch out this doorway so we can go and deport this son of a bitch. What's up, everyone? The deportation officer is headed your way, and he's got company. He's got some moves, so watch yourself. First number accepted. and the beeps are bad news for you guys. Oh, shut up. You know, for the fifth oldest thing in existence, I'd have thought you'd gotten bored with the sound of your own voice by now. You see, there can be peace between us after all. The foot 
doesn't make friends with the dog shit it steps in. I got a question. If you're so above us, why bother going after Rob Reed 20 years ago? Because he took her from me. Nix. Do not speak her name again. Someone's touchy. <laughs> you're right. I apologize. Such a petty human emotion. You see, the more time I spend inside this human vessel, the more infected I become with your little quirks. Seems like quite the posse of humans you've been hanging out with her. The cult. Well, that was Nix's idea. So when we first came back to this place, we were a shadow of our former selves. Taking your life force was the quickest way for us to get that Friday feeling again. Unfortunately, jumping from body to body leaves a trail for your agents to follow. So we decided to start our own farm. How'd that turn out? As disappointing as everything else in this world. Okay, they're heading towards the disused kitchen area. You can cut them off there. Copy that. They're gonna have to fight. No, no, no. I can't. Well, we're surrounded, so you're gonna have to man up. You take three, and I'll take three. I suppose you take five, and I take the other one. Just go hide. Sorry guys, kitchen's closed. They'll have to find somewhere else. I'll get him. Kill the girl. <laughs> Face is still pretty. Tick tock, tick tock. Time is almost up for you. Time's almost up for both of us. <sighs> That's not really true, though, is it? See, I might be going on an extended holiday, but you, you're going nowhere. The nothingness you came from. 
All right, pal, whatever you say. There it is. There what is? That moment of blind hope in his eyes. After everything he knows about the universe. About my kind. About where your kind comes from. In spite of that, he still thinks that maybe, just maybe, there's something after this life. A light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> Well, maybe we just keep you here instead of sending you back to your girlfriend. Let's see who's laughing then. Do you think that might happen? Because I don't. I've seen this moment. I've seen this room. I've seen me and her reunited. How? I told you. Time works differently for me. I think you should be more concerned with saying your goodbyes before you have to take your short train ride to oblivion. Fuck it. Red, can you hear me? I'm still here. I was afraid you got yourself killed. How are you holding up? Red. Just peachy. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be better. You still got our guest? Still in one piece. At least for now. That place is overrun. Some kind of elder cult. We know. They currently need a cult in the ELF in the deportation zone. It won't be long before they're in. Don't worry. I'll be in the blue zone soon. Gotta go. Listen, Ren, I... Stay safe, okay? Feels bad. <sighs> Move your hand. <sighs> yeah, you gotta crack crap. Oh, Ren? It sucks for you. girlfriend left me last week because she said I was too safe. Now look at me. I'm running around an underground facility fighting wannabe ninjas with a cracked rib so I can deport a god. So no, I'm not okay. Well, you know, for a guy with zero skills and no interest in what he's actually been doing for a job. All right. Thanks. Hey, um, 
Hey, when this uh, whole thing blows over, and if you're not busy and you do anything, um, would you like to go for a drink? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Never gonna happen. <laughs> oh, I said you were all right. I didn't see you were dateable. Oh, come on. The hero is supposed to get the girl. Dude, you're the sidekick. Tell me something. It. It, you know, him. Well, what's he trying to tell you? I think he wants me to deport him. Okay, Kerr, the deportation officer and the girl are headed towards the blue zone by the gym. Everyone else who's nearby get there now and back her up. I saw you. He showed you to me. So you're the girl. Talks about you all the time, you know. Really pisses me off. You must be the deportation officer. You're coming with me. Behave, and I'll let you keep your feet. Sam, go to the deportation room. Where? Two quarters down, turn left. Go! Go! Rude. I called dibs. Here they are! He's got company! Get her! <laughs> Time's almost up. Fuck you. No. He's right. I'm done. Do you want me to give her a message? No, I'll do it myself. You can give her this now. I need you to know 
something before I go. I need you to know how proud your dad would have been of what you've become. Whatever you do, don't give up. salvation finally here Kara come in is she dead she's down no fuck this I'm out I'm not getting caught by Artemis I have a family what about Kerr? what about her she's got nothing to lose get out of there it's over okay abort everyone find an exit or get left behind So he can't cross these? No. Doesn't stop his yapping, though, sadly. Well, well. Look at you. 
all these years of communicating with you across time and space. And now, here you are, all grown up. My visions, it was you. I told you, we are connected. Why? I see time in fragments, bits and pieces. All those years ago when I came to your home, I looked at you and I saw this day. I felt this pain that I feel now. And I knew. You what? That one day you would save me. <laughs> Listen. For everyone that isn't a batshit crazy god, do you just want to tell us what the fuck you're talking about? When your agents caught and deported my love, I was determined to bring her back. So I returned to our followers, and I began to drain them at speed to build up my strength. But they turned on me. Because of her. Sword girl? Her name is Kerr. They trapped me in a ward. Much like the one I am currently standing in. Making me change vessels weekly. They believe draining the blood of my vessel and drinking it gives them power. Which is total bullshit, by the way. It is excruciating pain for me, though. I reached out to you many times, Red. But human brains are far too weak to grasp my true voice. Yours is stronger than most, though. If that makes you feel better. So that means you're not crazy. How did you end up here? I realized what I'd seen when I looked at you all those years ago. My deportation. My reunion with Nyx. So I escaped. And then purposely got myself caught by your agents. You want to be deported. I had spent eons over there, weakened, longing to come back. But now, it would appear this universe is not just a cool joke on your kind, but mine too. I see it now, though. It is this world that is hell. You know, I always thought it was me that was afraid. That I was too scared from seeing the real you to live my life properly. You say you've been feeling pain. But I know you're lying. It's not pain, is it? It's fear. You're scared you're just as meaningless as the rest of us. Send me back now and let's finish this. I could just give you the current and let you suffer. Bad God. Who let you off your leash? Deport me now, or I'll snap her neck. Do it, Sam. Shut him up. Looks like you're gonna have to find yourself a new god. I like you. Shame I have to kill you. Might as well die with some honor.
zu. Anan zu. Gitter zu. God now. <laughs> said something to me that night. I see you. You will see me. Don't you ever forget my face, motherfucker. You don't do. Most important now, I. Eh? Not bad for a side case. Not bad at all. Jay's funeral arrangements. He, uh, he wanted you to have this. I, you've earned it. 
Welcome to active duty. Man. Fucking black site. 